G'day, I'm Joe from Professional CAD Systems. Uh, we're the New Zealand distributors for Peel 3D. So today I'm going to take you through how to correctly upgrade your Peel 3D software to the latest version. So this will work for all future versions as well. So the first thing I would recommend is going to careform3d.com. Next, go to the customer center. If you haven't done so already, I would suggest requesting access to the customer center. So you just click on this link here. Just fill in your name, uh, your address, phone number, email, a preferred password, obviously your company name, and the serial number for your scanner can be found on the bottom of your 3D scanner, the physical device itself. Or if unsure, contact your distributor. So once you're logged in, you'll see my products. So once you're in the my products area, you'll see your Peel 3D scanner. And if you had purchased the Peel to CAD or the CAD module, you'll also see this here as well. So to upgrade to the latest version of the software, you need to click on the download link here for the download of the latest software. and we'll install that first. If you have a previous version of Peel, however, I would recommend that you go to your control panel. So go start menu, search control panel, and then click on uninstall the program. If you don't have this particular view in the control panel, you can change your category or change it by to view by category. You can click uninstall the program and then you just need to find the peel software and uninstall. Okay, so once that's done, you can then, oops, just drag that back. So you can then get the download and this should be either in your downloads folder or on your desktop depending on where you downloaded it to, and just double click on that download. If this comes up, that's not a problem. Just click on more info and then run anyway. Okay, so I want to install it for United States English. Okay, then go to the next screen. Next again, install. Okay, so we do want to launch the product manager and we do want to download the latest help files. So we'll say finish. Okay, and you can see here that um, I have my Peel 2 scanner. Um, it has a license file that's available to be downloaded. But if you're not seeing the status in here of what's available, you will need to connect to the customer center. So in the bottom left-hand corner here, you just click on connect. Make sure you click connect and remember password. Enter in your email and your password, then OK and it will connect to Creaform servers. And then you will be able to, um, yeah, update the licenses. So I just click on the download button. We go OK. And then we'll try downloading the peel to cad software. OK, cool. So that's just how you would do it if you're connected through the product manager. But let's say you didn't want to do it through the product manager. You can actually go to the customer center where you downloaded um, the software and you can download the license file for your scanner and the calibration file. So if we were to download that license file first, we'll just pop it into the desktop and then I'll download the calibration file. And I'll also download the license file for the Peel to CAD USB dongle. 
So I can click on that. So this is just if you're not going to be doing it through the product manager. So here's the license files. And so the CLF is for the scanner license file. So career form license file. The CST is a configuration file, which is calibration file. And the CKU is the dongle license or the USB stick. So if we go back into the product manager, you just click on the start menu and go to product manager. Oh, wrong one. Peel product. Okay. So it's just called the Peel 3D product manager. So just in the start menu, search for that. Okay, so if you click on the Peel to CAD, Oh, the peel two, sorry. You can actually go change and then you can go and browse for that license. So I can download or upload the CST and I can browse for the license file. It isn't going to change for me in this instance because I managed to already download that license file. But it seems like my peel to CAD hasn't updated properly. So to update the USB stick or the peel to CAD dongle, you just need to make sure it's plugged in to your computer, then you just simply double click on the CKU file and that will transfer the license over to the USB stick. So don't worry about this. I also have career form 3D scanners and the product manager is the same. So we'll just restart the product manager. So I'm just searching under the start menu for Peel 3D product manager. And you can now see that my license has been correctly updated. So even though it says invalid version, I know that I've done it cor correctly. So we can just go and double click on the Peel 3D software. You can accept the terms and conditions. If you want to help um, contribute to improving the Peel software, feel free to leave that on and then you do not have to show this dialogue again. So we'll just go new scan, even though I don't have a, a scan. Sorry, I don't have the scanner connected to do a scan. We'll just adjust this to fit the recording area. So one way we can test to see if we've installed the license file for the USB dongle correctly is to import a mesh and see if we have the CAD tools available to us still. So we go to the file menu, import mesh. We'll just search for a scan that I've already got on file. Import that and you can see the 3D mesh there now and the tools along the top. So I've got all the CAD entity tools that you'd expect with the people to CAD. Thanks for your time and all the best with installing Peel 3D.